smelly that <laughs> always smells like trash. Leave me alone, Tyrone. Unfortunately, I won't be leaving until you move. Move where and for what, Tyrone? Move off my swing. Um, I don't see your name anywhere on here, so it's not your swing. Oh, yeah? I'm about to make it my swing. You're nasty. See, this is why nobody likes you because you're annoying, mean, and don't forget, nasty. Guess what, Callie? What? I put this shoulder up, and I put this shoulder up, and then I drop them. You want to know why? I really don't want to know. You know what? Just have your swing back. Because I don't care. I don't care. Tyrone's swing. Look at him over there on my swing. You know what? Why that boy stinks and I got snacks and he doesn't. She's eating snacks? She didn't tell me she had snacks. She didn't tell me you brought a snack. Tyrone, what do you think you're doing? I'm taking your snacks. What does it look like? No, you're not. You listen here, you booger eating twerp. These are my snacks and my snacks only. I just realized, Callie, you must don't know who you're talking to. Oh, trust me, I know and I don't care because you don't scare me. Are you scared now? Mm. Well, since you did that, let me think about it. Mm. No. But you will be. <laughs> yeah, so, Callie, 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 are you scared now? <laughs> now run off before I make the other side match. <laughs> oh, you left me some snacks? How kind of you. I would love to eat them. <laughs> Chris, wake up! Chris, please wake up! <laughs> Girl, what's wrong with you? I need you to come and beat somebody up. Uh-uh, bro, go get somebody else to do it. Please, please. He? It was a boy? Yeah, look, he did this. It's just stuck. Where you at? Last time I seen him, he was at, ow, ow, he was at the fort. Uh-uh. There ain't no way that happened. Ain't nobody messing with my sister but me. What are you gonna do with the- Girl, stop asking all those questions. Let's go. Ugh, come on, you stupid bro. Come on. Hurry up before he leaves. Don't you see me trying? Man, just go make sure he's still here. Dude, nobody told you to bring that thing anyways. Well, well, well. I see you found your way back to the park, Callie. I hope we didn't come for your snacks because I ate them already. She don't hear me talking to her. Hello? You don't hear me talking to you? I'm ignoring you. I'm ignoring you. I hope he knows when my brother comes. He's not going to be doing all that talking. <laughs> I know you hear me. Remember what I said about that other... Go away. I'm busy. I think you might want to turn around for this one. Fine. Whoever you... Uh, 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 can, can I help you, sir? Yeah. Let me see your hand, tough guy. <laughs> Here you go. Now walk ow, with you. You broke my sister's hand. No, 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 I didn't. Yes, you did. Big sir with big muscle man. No. Boy, I ain't asking you. I seen it with my own eyes. Okay, okay. I'm sorry, but I didn't mean to. Yeah, he said he's sorry. Do we believe him? Um, uh, ex excuse me. Uh, who are you talking to? My friends. Boy, you can't see them sitting right here. Do I see them? Oh, uh, what was that? You said I should break it? Break, break it? B break what? All right, say no I more. Can't lie this for my it. sister, boy. Wait. Go get back in the car. You brought me here, so I'm about to break. No, you're not. Even though he deserves what he did to me, then to him, we're not him, so we're just gonna let him go. Really? Really? Yes, really. Okay, see you later. Bye. Not so fast. I'm not done with you. You're not. No, no, no. <laughs> all right, I'm all done. Oh, <laughs> uh, what's so funny? Oh, I think you should see for yourself. <laughs> That'll teach him not to mess with me again. Uh, what shoe is he putting? Shoes are so tight. 
I bet I bet I can beat you to the car, you little bitch. Bet you can. Come on then.
my god, man, I'm gonna get in trouble. So, Tiki and Jimmy, they don't trust us, so when we come home from school, they don't give us a key. So look, this is how and we lock it. And do you see why they don't give us a key, Layla? Uh, Layla, you just locked us out the house. Well, I have a code. You ready to hear my code? Okay, so today's code that they gave me was... Layla, are you showing the code? Um, wait, no, I'm not. Don't look. Don't look. Don't show the code. Uh-oh. Time expired. What does oh that mean? Oh my god, you see why I always okay. get in trouble Four, with Layla? Five, two, six. Stop looking. Layla. Nine, eight. And you're saying it out loud? Oh, sorry. Really? Why are you being a party pooper? Do you see why Uncle Jimmy and Auntie T don't trust us now? Why? Because you literally just tried to show them I the code. I didn't show them the code. You, you just guys? said it out loud. I told you well. Call your parents and don't listen. I wasn't trying to. Who wouldn't listen? You're literally giving them a free pass to I come in here and steal my room. You don't even have anything in your room. Stop spitting on me. Look, Wait, guys. You can only they show have my a closet. Oh. It's just a closet. Okay, oh, and look. Then. Can I tell them? Okay, so look guys, look guys. A living room. Oh, this is this is by far almost my favorite part. And then look, look, look. They have a big kitchen. Oh! 
doing too much. Now show your room and we're ending this video. This is my room, guys. <laughs> Circle. That's how small it is. Yeah, because you don't even know how to do a circle. That's why you're dumb. Layla, just show your stinking Okay, name. well, get me here. Well, come on, come in the room. Sorry. Come on. Okay, this is my room, guys. And That's it? Two, two, and that's two kids. I don't know what I'm gonna get. Wait, but what about wait? What? Why can I get anything? Where's your dad? I don't know, but my like, dad. I thought you were her dad. I'm not her dad. Wait, that's what I'm I thought dad. too. Wait, but still, guys, listen. Why can't I get any food and they get food? They got four fours, and I want five five. If anything, I could just get a four four too. Wait, so who's your dad? Mind your business. You need to call your dad for that, not me. But Hey, you need to call your mom. I ain't got nothing to do with me. Okay. But he's speaking to you. Yeah, I'm gonna get so, food. So you want the four fours and the four fours. You want the Junior Frosty and the high C. Both high C's. Two high C's. Yeah, two high C's. Yes. Okay, and I, okay, perfect. And y'all want any cookies or anything? Oh, I want, can I at least I, have I, a... I wasn't, hold on, hold on. I wasn't talking to you yet. Okay. I want five. Five chocolate chips, yeah. And I want oatmeal raisins. Oatmeal raisin? Mm -hmm. I, want, I want raisin. raisin. All right, I'm gonna see y'all when I get back. I love raisin. Right. Thank you. I'm gonna see y'all when I get back. Your mom, 
Excuse me, when are you talking to help you? Hi, good afternoon. Can I have two four for fours, please? All right, for the first one, what uh, drink would you like? Both of them are Sprites, both honey mustard. You got that? Uh, yes, both Sprite, both honey mustard, anything else? Uh, do you have a for uh? Never mind. That's that's everything. Actually, I'm gonna be a good. Day. Let me get a uh. Let me get the biggie. You know what? Never mind. Never mind, man. Never mind. I'm gonna that that complete my order. So just two four four. Uh, right on. All right. So it's gonna be eight sixty six. Uh, that's just two four four fours, right? Yes. Nothing else. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna see you at the window. All right. All right. Damn kids think I was going <laughs> I'm a man of my word I stand on it I ain't buying you nothing I ain't buying you nothing Hey y'all fool here Come eat See I told you Tell me what Give it to me Dad's back He brought us food Like we said So you really think He brought me some food Yeah come on Let's go see what he got <laughs>
Ei! Mm -hmm. oh. What Layla mama want, eh? I just called the police. And they come to check on my baby. Who baby? My baby? Bill, you got a bill? You have to be You can't play your name and our sister, right? I'm talking to her. I don't know, right? Well, can I at least get on a pad? No, you're not allowed to. Guys, what? the police are coming. The police? Why is the police coming? Wait, I didn't do it, Dad. I told you I pooped on the floor just one time. No, no. You <laughs> It's because of Snitch Girl they're coming. Ooh. I know you but your mom, she just texted me. Oh, oh my God, Snitch! Wait, I'm not a Snitch. Wait, what is she snitching oh, about? Wait, Dad. She called and told her mom that we didn't feed her. Oh, Dad, what's a snitch again? Telling on us. Oh, so you snitched on us? No, I didn't. Well, you didn't feed her, Dad. I don't blame her. Okay, well, that doesn't matter. The cops are on their way, and I'm going to need y'all to lie for me, okay? Hold on, wait, Dad. Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. You want them to lie? It's okay once in a while to do it. Now I need y'all to do so it. So that, does that mean when I when I don't want to go to school, I can lie to you? No, and you can't lie Wait, to me. So the police are coming to find out the truth about me, but you want them to lie for you. Maybe they wouldn't have to lie if you could keep your mouth shut. Maybe they wouldn't have to lie. Guys, the cops are on the way. I'm gonna use that light for me, okay? That's that, and I. Oh, that's lying, is it? That's right? me. How you doing today, officer? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. How can I do for you? Uh, it took you a little minute to get to the door. Do you not know where your door is? No, I know where my door is. I was just in the kitchen. Okay, um, I, I had know. a call about a malnourished kid, and I'm here to do a checkup. There's no malnourished kid here. I'll be the judge of that. I had a call to this address. Can I ask who called you? That's none of your business. That's disclosed. This is my house. As my job, I'm not allowed to disclose that type of information, sir. So may I come in and check? I have to speak to all the kids and make sure that nobody the is kids. Started. You said you had kids, right? Yes. Did you forget you had kids? No. You just why you want to speak to my kids? Because I have to speak to the kids to make sure. They're not malnourished and they're feeding. Uh, come on in, come on in. Thank you. Let me know if you need you know, a bottle of water. No, I don't need anything. I heard you don't feed your kids. I, I don't feed my kids. Who told you that? Uh, can you go ahead and lead me to the kitchen? Today's Sunday. You, I, I, I thought I was some Sunday dinner. I'm fine, sir. All right. Kids, come on out. Yes, sir. Please. Hi, guys. I'm sorry. Jeez. Why are you guys arguing? Guys, guys. Arguing. She just pushed me for no reason. You in my way. Oh, uh, uh. hey, Mr. Officer. Hi, officer. Hi. Officer. Uh, what are you doing here? Dad, what are you doing here? That's not your dad. If you want to keep calling my dad, if you want to call me dad. Yeah. I don't know why she keep doing that. Yeah. Are we are we in trouble? You're not in trouble. Just answer his questions. Uh, I'm just here to do a checkup to make sure you all are good. Um, yeah, I'm fine. I did lose in Fortnite, but I'm good. I mean, I, I feel totally fine. So what about you, miss? Are, are you good? Um, they're, um, they're, I mean, yeah. I'm fine too, officer. I'm okay being here alone with these people, especially that man right there. You see, officer, it's nothing wrong today. It's nothing. I don't know who gave you that phone call, but as you can see, it's nothing wrong here. So you can just wrap this up and just have a nice day today. You know what I'm saying? I'll be the judge of that. I have to talk to each one of them privately. Talk to them. What do you mean privately? You can't talk to my kids privately. Yes, I can. And I also will. I'm scared. Oh All right, God. let's just hurry up and get this over with. Uh, Layla, he's gonna speak to you first. Yeah, Layla, I think you should go first because you're not our our sister. Wait. You're not really our sibling, so just take the heat. Why do you guys want me to go? I have to go first, officer. No, little lady, you don't have to go first. Okay, good. No, no please, not me. No, not I me. said her. I think the officer said not me, so he's not talking about me. He's gonna let somebody else go. Hey, you with the angry beaver shirt, you'll go first. Oh! oh Guys, make sure y'all tell him the truth. Everybody ate, okay? Do not go in there and then switching up your stories. Everybody eats here. Do not make daddy look bad, all right? All right, come on, little lady. Come take a seat right here for me. Um, hi, Mr. Officer. Hey, how you doing? Um, I'm, I'm doing fine. Um, How are you? Why is that light in my face? Uh, I have to have this light in your face as part of my job as a COP, as a cop. Um, can you put it down, please? I can't. I'm the one asking the questions here, man. Okay. All right, so did I'm you I'm a little girl. Okay. Yeah. What'd you have for dinner? Um, actually it was lunch and um I had four for four. Okay, and you had numbers for dinner or lunch? Um no, it's Wendy's. Oh, okay, okay. And what about your brother? Did he eat too? Duh, he ate. What we always eat? eat. Four for fours, I just told you. So you guys eat the same thing um, every day? No, no, 
no. Um, we asked for that and our dad got it. We had burger um, nuggies with um, honey mustard. That's our favorite. And fries and drinks. And But our dad forgot our um thing. Do you think you can get us one? He forgot our strawberry frosty. Uh, that's not my job, ma'am. But okay. what about your sister? Did she eat? Um, um, Layla? That's your sister, right? Yeah. Um, yeah, she, she ate. What did she eat? Um, and I just wanted to let you know that lying to me results in jail time. Jail? Yeah, as in you'll be locked in bars and you won't be able to see your mom or your dad or your brother or your sister. Um, well, can we have nuggets in jail? No. Um, I'll let you in a little secret if I can take a sip of my water really quick. Right. Any day now, ma'am. All right, ma'am, I'm gonna need an answer now. Play with me. And why didn't she? Um, something about um her dad is not me and my brother's dad, and um, she can't have nuggies with us, so she don't eat. Did he tell you to lie to me? Uh, I have to go to the bathroom. All this water, this water is filling up my. You no, know just go ahead. Um, tell your little brother I said come um, on in here, so I have some questions for you. Okay. Alright, what did he say? You know, lady. You, I'm Alex. I'm they want to see you next. Why me? I thought Layla was going next. Um, they said she has to go last. They want see you just just oh, come on. Wait, did you really like to him? Um that, that, that doesn't matter. What, what did you tell him? I told him that we ate. You told him everything that you ate. But I That's my girl. Good job. That's what I'm talking about. I guess it's my turn. Go on out there, Allie. Don't get worry, him. Dad. I'm not no snitch. Get him, champ. Right, come on, young man. Have a seat. I don't bite. Oh, don't you worry, Mr. Officer. Your boy Alex has been bitten a few times. Oh, really? By who? I see what you're trying to do. You're trying to trick me. Oh, no. Never. Well, just get on with the questions, Mr. Officer, now. So, did you eat yesterday? Of course I ate. Why wouldn't I? I don't know. Why wouldn't you? Maybe your dad starved you. <laughs> My dad would never do that. Why wouldn't he? Uh, because if you didn't know, for your FYI, my dad feeds all of his kids. Oh, interesting. So what did you eat yesterday? I actually had breakfast, lunch, and dinner. What I ate, you don't need to know. Oh, that's good. Did the little girl eat? Oh, yeah, the little girl, my sister, she's actually not little. She's older than me, but she did eat. No, I'm talking about the other girl. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, she, she ate. Hmm. What is she? And let me just remind you, if you lie to me, you're going to jail. Jail? My dad didn't tell me anything about jail. So, did she? Um. Yeah. Did she really? No. She, she, she hasn't dated in four days. I, 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 I tried to tell my dad, but, but he wouldn't give her anything. He just always says, that's not my kid. I only feed my kid. Thank you. That's all. Can you call her in here for me? Layla, come on in. Hurry, my officer. I did, ma'am. I'm going to need you to tell me everything that happened yesterday. Um, I don't want to get anybody in trouble, so I'd rather just keep it to myself. Would you want to go to jail? Oh, definitely. Now I definitely tell you. What do you want to know? Everything that happened yesterday. Okay. Yesterday, um, so we was all in our planning games, and, um, he came in the room and he said, what does everybody want? So, everybody told him what they want. Everybody wanted four fours. So, I said I wanted a five five, but he told me no. So, I said, okay, I'll just get a four four. He told me that I wasn't his kid. He wasn't going to waste his money on me. So, he didn't give me anything to eat. <sighs> and then, when he came back with the food, and I found out he didn't give me anything to eat. Um, Yasmin, the other girl, they're not really my brother and sister. They didn't even clean me, so I'm not claiming them. But, so Yasmin tried to give me a piece of her burger, and he told her to take her burger from me. Or she was going to be on punishment. So she took her burger from me and she didn't get on punishment. And that was about it. Then I went and I called my mommy and, well, I don't know what my mommy did after that. She said she was going to handle it. Well, yeah. she handled it. I'm here. Okay, so what are you going to do about it? I'm going to need you to go ahead and go to the room. I pretty much need <laughs> I already knew everything that was going on already. This was pretty much a waste of time. I just wanted to hear everybody's so, side. So it's just a waste of time and you came here to make sure that I, I ate and I did eat. You're still not going to do anything? I'm going to do something. Just go to your room. Give me some time to think, all right? Fine. All right, officer, I hope you got everything that you needed today. You've seen that the kids ate. They're in great shape, great form. Um, I can just escort you on your way out, and we can just wrap this up. Oh, just to let you know, sir, I did come and get what I needed, and I'm leaving with somebody today just to let that be known. Oh, you guys don't worry. 
You guys don't need to argue. It's not any of you. It's actually you, mister. Oh, oh wait, you're not Me? You? Yeah, you. My I know what you've been doing. You've lied to me about these kids. They all told on you just to let you know. Told on what? They all eat. Yeah, they all eat. And they also told me that she didn't eat. Ooh. They all ratted you out, sir. Now you're going to go ahead and come on with me. Me? I'm not ready for jail.
So now start talking. Yeah! Now start talking! Mm, okay, so it starts like this. I was in the kitchen getting ready to enjoy a beautiful bowl of cereal. Then Casey came in and says... Hello, stinky boy Alex. Casey, you can't continue being mean to me like that. I can do what I want. Hey, you're not going to wash that? No, why would I? Well, because you need to always wash after yourself. It's just the right thing to do. Yeah, yeah, whatever. So she walks out the kitchen and I'm like, I can't believe she do such a thing. What a rude young lady. I just watch it so mom doesn't get mad at us. I had just finished washing the dishes, but as I was walking out <gasps> the kitchen, I spotted a piece of dirt on the floor. Uh-oh. There's no way we have dirt out the vacuum and clean the whole house. There's no way. Okay, Mr. Vacuum, we're going to get all this dirt up. Let's go. <laughs> what are you doing? What do you mean? What am I doing? What does it look like I'm doing? It looks like you're being mean to me and I'm plugging the cleaner thing so I can't clean up. Well, that's Get to it already. Okay, so where was I? Oh, oh my god, that was a lot of work. That's it, folks. Those clothes up ASAP. What? 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 Why can't you do it? Because they're not mine. What? Isn't this your shirt? Uh, yeah, but I don't care. Just do it now or else. Man, that boy is so annoying. Sometimes I wish I had superpowers so I could turn him into a little itty bitty and and crush him. Man, I love my sister. A big beautiful princess. Alice! Yes, and this beautiful Casey. Come here, boy! Coming here! Did you just call me dude? Oh uh, yeah, why? You do not ever, ever, ever talk to this princess like that. Well, if you want me to call you princess, you know you can just say that, right? Call Okay, Princess K, how can I serve you? Could you please change the channel to something funnier? So you called me out here to change the... Are you questioning the princess? Oh, no, Princess K, just trying to understand... Mommy, he's fibbing. There is no way I would even talk like... Casey, it's my story. Mommy asked me what I remember. It, it does sound a little crazy, though, Alex. Oh, Mommy, you don't believe me? That's not what I said. So what are you saying? I'm telling you what everything that that mean girl over there did. Yeah, but I never even said any of that. Mom, can I just tell my part? No, I'm still waiting on him to tell me. Now, everything you sit here telling us, is it true, Alex? Yes, 100 gazillion bazillion percent true. Now, anyways, getting back to... Wait, why do you keep looking at the ceiling? <laughs> Please let me finish, Casey. Okay, storyteller. Thanks. Now, before I was rudely interrupted, you said... Turn on a princess show right now. Sure. Where's the remote at? Um, I don't know. You find it. Hey, you know you can help me, right? <laughs> me? A princess? Leave my throne? Uh, yeah. Never. Uh, No, I did not. Yes, you did. Catch this. Wait a 
minute. Oh, then now you have the remote to the broken TV. Just because I have it, that doesn't mean I broke it. You know that, right? Oh, really? Well, when Mama comes out, what you gonna say? The truth. I'm gonna tell her you threw the remote at me. You broke that TV, and then you tried to blame me. You think she's gonna believe you? Yeah, why wouldn't she always tell the truth? <laughs> Dude, that's so not cool. Well, if that's all that you say happened, then why nowhere in your story was you on the ground like you was when I came out here? Oh. Exactly. I can tell you why, Mommy. Well, tell me then, because from the look of it, you broke my TV. No, he did it. And that's for what he said. Is it true? It's so true. It's not. Yes, it is, Dookie Head. Well, before I decide, I need to hear from your sister. Wait, why would you need to hear from her? I already told you how she did it. Because I said so. Ah, whatever. Go ahead, you mean girl. I'm not mean. I'm very nice. Now, this is what really happened, Mommy. Prepare yourselves for what I'm about to tell you. Because it can get quite you see, Mommy, she's already telling a story. Oh, really? How so? It's simple, Mommy. It's right in your face. She said I didn't tell the truth when I actually did. You heard it. I did hear your side, but now I'm going to let your sister tell me what she remembers. <laughs> now, this is what really happened, Mommy. I was just sitting in the living room minding my business being the good girl that I am when I heard Stinky Boy Alex. <laughs> TV. Mom, I'm getting there. Hey, Casey, this story is interesting. What happens next? Oh, wouldn't you like to know? Alex, um, I found something in your undies. Ooh, no, no, those are mine. Well, these are your undies, and this is your closet, so I think this is your poop. Alex, you don't know how to wash your clothes? I do, mommy, I do. <laughs> mommy, it's just a big baby. Say it again, I bet you watch your dog 
dare you, oh! Alex, you are a big baby! Mommy, make her stop! Casey, if you don't tell me who broke my TV, it's gonna be both of y'all fault. Casey, just get through the line already! So, I apologize, and then that's when Alex said... Go wash my clothes right now! Obviously, but you find them. So fighters, keepers, losers, weepers. You know what, mister? You wash your own clothes. <laughs> now I'm going to tell all of your friends that you have pooped on your face. <laughs> no way she's telling that little Lily won't want to hang out with me anymore. I gotta stop her. Jessica, you won't believe what just happened. Sorry to interrupt you, but mom actually wants to know how I broke the TV. Not how you telling your fake friends. Ah, I'm telling her how I remember. So could you please stop interrupting me and listen? Just saying, this sounds a little made up. Mommy, do you believe me or her? Me. Now listen, you said. I see if you don't hang that phone up right now. I'm going to tell mommy that you left poop in that toilet and then you tried to put it on my face. No. She'll never, ever, ever believe your made-up story because you never tell the truth. So once I said that, Alex turned into the incredible, bad, evil Hulk. He started throwing things and just going crazy. You are not telling me and get me in trouble. Alex, Why wasn't I? Uh, she woke mommy up. Mm, uh, mm, mm, mm. Exactly, because she didn't tell the truth. I did, so she did it. Now, hold on now, because both of y'all left something out. What do you mean? Right, because I didn't leave anything out of mine. Oh, but you did. Now, I'm going to tell y'all what I really think happened and which one of y'all really broke my TV. Where do you think she's going? supposed to know i don't know i just thought you might would have known hi how are you yes i'm bad um my kids broke my tv and they won't tell me which one did it so i need someone to come and help me. sorry ma'am um i don't know how to help you there oh okay okay i got it so what if you brought over a device that made them think that they was going to take a lie detector test yes ma'am uh that'll work uh, i can do that and we can tell them that if they come clean then nobody will get in trouble but if they keep sticking to their lie and lie detector show who the lie is then I'm gonna file some charges for them destroying property. Your kids destroyed somebody's property? Oh yeah, that ain't no big deal. Um, They just spray painted the teacher's house because she decided to give everybody their report card. Mmm, okay, I see. We'll be over there with the equipment in an hour, ma'am. Okay, thank you so much, sir. Um, see you soon. Alex and Casey, come here! Yes, ma'am? Did you call us to tell us we're getting a puppy? No. Since both of y'all left something out of y'all little stories about who broke my TV, the police is on their way and they bring in a lie detector machine. Lie detector? Yes. And I'm giving them permission to hook both of y'all up to it. Hey, you can't do that. I can and I did. Whoever did it is in big trouble. But mommy. No, no, I gave both of y'all the opportunity to tell me the truth. But it seems like neither one of y'all know what that is. But I do know. I already told you. Yeah. And so did I. I don't care. They're going to be here in a little bit. Y'all go back in that living room and do whatever y'all was doing. <laughs> See, she really thinks we're going to believe that. She would never hook her kids up to a lie detector test. Just don't, Casey, don't believe her. You really think I'm believing her? I was just acting. I don't believe mommy for one second. There is no way in the world a police officer is going to come to our house and test us two kids on a lie detector test. Yeah, you're right. Wait. 
Do you even think that's legal for kids anyway? No, that's what I'm saying. She's just trying to scare us by lying to us. You know, that's probably where we get it from when she's telling us to tell people that she's not here. She's really here because she's telling us to say she's not here. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And what about all the time when those people call asking her to pay her bill? She always talking about something. I don't have the money. I don't have the money. But then she ends up going shopping with her friends and she never brings us. We always got to stay here. See, that's where we get it from. Yeah. <laughs> You're making your sister seem like a bad person. And Casey, you making your brother seem like a bad person. I just wish that y'all two would answer my question with the truth instead of taking me through all of this. But mom! Now, remember, if you can do the crime, you better be ready to do the time. The time? I'm not ready to do the time. Oh, there they go. The actually came. Mm, don't be scared now. Come on. Thank you for coming. Hello, ma'am. All right, well, y'all come on in. Thank, Thank you, you very, very much. much. Look at his mustache. <laughs> I know, it's so cute. What is this you are putting your mother through? <gasps> when you do something wrong or mess up, be a big enough person to say that you did something that wasn't cool. If you have to suffer the consequences, then so be it. You must think about the consequences of your actions before you do something wrong or bad. After you consider the consequences and you find out if it's not good or if it's good, then you don't do it. Um, Alex, what even is a consequence? I don't know. I think he might have said it wrong. I think he's talking about the state Connecticut. I want to let you two in on a little secret. In my line of work, we usually always catch the bad guy. Oh, uh, Mr. Puny Mustache Man, it's not really a secret if you tell it to somebody. Right, and I'm a girl, not a boy, so I can't be a bad guy. Okay, Missy, well, I work with some very smart people who know how to figure all this stuff out. Yeah, so if you want to come clean, now's the time to do so. Because once they hook y'all up to that machine and they start that little process, they can't stop. They can't stop! Nope. Oh, uh, Mom, question, um, does it hurt? No, it won't hurt at all. So, how does this machine work exactly? Because I don't think it can really detect if I am telling the story. I think you're trying to scare the gummy bears out of me. This is my polygraph technician, Miss Lolly. Lolly? Like lollipop? <laughs> Cassie, did you hear that? Yes, Alex, I heard you. It was whack. Now, I will have Miss Lolly over here explain how the machine works. Go ahead, Miss Lolly. <clears throat> Hello, kids. The lie detector test is the most popular test used in the United States. The polygraph test is this machine right here measures your physiological features such as your heart rate, blood pressure, perspiration, respiration, and skin conductivity. Say what? It measures what? The machine measures your physiological features such as your blood pressure, heart rate, perspiration, respiration, and skin conductivity. <laughs> yeah, sound like a bunch of snitching if you ask me. No, Casey, that just sounds like some creepy stuff to me. And I don't want anything hooked up to my body checking my skin connection. Skin activity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm with my brother on that one. That's creepy. So to simplify it, it measures the changes of a person's body as they respond to a question or statement. Ma'am, you are correct. What is this language you people are speaking? I don't know, Casey, and I really don't want to find out. What? Let's get started. So either y'all two is gonna tell me who broke my TV, or they gonna hook y'all up behind us up to that little lie detector test, and they gonna tell me who did it. End of story. Oh, uh, when did it even start? <laughs> you got her, Alex. Oh yeah? Alex, get your behind in that chair. You're going first. No, wait, wait, but mommy, it wasn't me. I, I promise, I didn't do it, right, Casey? Mm, okay, 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 I'll tell you what happened. And it better be the truth, or we're gonna do that little test. So, we was playing hot potato with the remote, and we threw the remote high up in the air. We had to jump to catch the remote, you know, like Michael Jordan and LeBron James when they play basketball. So you're really gonna tell the truth, Casey? Okay, for the record, I was the 
LeBron James. No, I was LeBron James, but that's besides the point. But Casey. Don't interrupt me anymore, Alex. Okay, I won't. Sorry. Keep going. So, like I was saying, we was jumping in the air to catch the remote because, you know, we was playing hot potato and all. So, it was down to the wire. Nine and nine. The score is tied. Well, Alex here threw the remote up in the air. We both jumped. The remote came the down, we both had our hands on it. Since we both caught it, I wasn't letting go, and I knew Alex wasn't gonna let go. Nope, I wasn't letting her win. No way. So, we agreed, since we was trying to reach 10, we would just count to 10, and then we would throw the remote in the air. Whoever caught it, they would win. Oh, really? Ma, Ma, you gotta understand. I ain't trying to tell it. Oh, sorry, go ahead. Anyways, so our Turn to the TV at this time. So we started the countdown. We said 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And by the time we reach 1, we throw the remote tip in the air. Before we had time to turn around, we just heard a loud noise. Okay, Casey, that's enough. It's not too late to turn back. Both broke my TV? Yes, I think that's what they're saying. Thank you, sir. Now, since both of y'all didn't tell me the truth the first time I asked y'all, this is what I want y'all to do.